Hello and welcome to your number one talk show powered by Deliveroo TV, The Core. And my name is Faye. And definitely today I'm super, super, super excited because we're going to be going into the life, the nitty gritty of a known actor, MC, presenter, fashion tutor, and lots more. He's just the man who has so many talents embedded, embodied in just one body. But guys, definitely for those just tuning in, we're going to be telling you a bit about The Core. We talk about everything and anything, topics, the lives of our celebrities, and games and fuse to give it a very wowy day to kickstart your day. But we go on another short one right now just to know who our guest is. And when we return, the full discussion continues. Keep it locked, guys. We'll be right back. It is time to know who our celebrity guest for today is. He is none other than Nigerian fashion tutor, designer, model, presenter, MC, and actor, Ifanyi Kalu. An alumni of Lagos State University, he has acted alongside Ruth Kadiri, Ebu Benwagbo, Belinda Afa, to mention a few. He is the CEO of fashion establishment Ifanyi Kalu Clothing. Ladies and gentlemen, give it up for our guest, Ifanyi Kalu. <laughs> and I just saw your beads are totally matching. We'll just uh, do like a deeper life kind of um, shake here. Okay. Yeah, since we can't come too far. Yeah. But great to have you here, though. You look really nice. Thank really you, nice. Thank you, thank I was going to. Size of your shoes? Um, they don't matter right now. Let's just get done. No size of your shoes. They really don't matter. Because really? someone will want to steal them after we have been done with this. I don't know. I don't know what size. You really don't know <laughs> size of your shoes. All right. So great to have you here, though. Yeah. Yes. I, do, I can't remember. Have you always been growing beards, or this is just the new look for you? Um, yeah. I have always had a beard. Um, yeah. Sometimes I just let it go really full. But the other ones, the gray, it's like old age setting in right no, it's now. It's not old age, it's more like, you know, wisdom. You know, I get wiser by the day. Why, why did the tone you know? of your voice change? Like, it's just yeah, wisdom. So when we talk about wisdom, you know, the tone of your voice changes. <laughs> it has to change. Yeah, it has to change because there's a voice. You know, wisdom comes in a certain kind of voice. Mm -hmm. you know? It's not for. A rebellion comes in another type of voice. I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, you don't? <laughs> <laughs> All right, so moving on. What inspired your look today? Uh, we know you to be a fashion tutor, so tell us a bit about your look today. Okay, for me, it's about how how I feel. It's about the mood. Okay. You know, um, I really do not plan my looks ahead of time. You know, I just get to my wardrobe, open it up, and, you know, I just look at Based it. Based on how you're feeling, you just speak. It's, just it's, it's about mm. how I feel. Okay. You know, but then ultimately the goal is one just has to look good. Mm -hmm. You know, but on a scale of one to ten, I mean, just rate your dressing today. No, you should do that. No, I wouldn't. No, you should. You saw yourself in the mirror. When yeah, you saw yourself well, in the mirror, what did you see? I'm like, dude, you look good. Good or great? But I didn't. Oh yeah, you weren't saying that. <laughs> <laughs> on a scale of one to ten, I think um, eight. Oh, good. For some reasons. Uh, yeah. That you'd rather not tell us, yeah? If you want to know, I don't Oh, mind. yeah, please tell us. Let's get on to the next one. All oh, right. <laughs> okay, so what is the typical life, um, you know, of um, of you? Like, your typical life, what do you do? What do you get up to? Apart from acting, the the fashion, tutoring, and all that, what else do you get up to? The uh, life I, of your person. Whew, I love family. You know, I love my family. Um, I'm not married, so when I talk I was, about family, I was coming <laughs> to that question. When what? I talk about family, I'm not talking about the, I'm not talking about the one that you know I have created yet. The uh, one you're still part of. Yeah, the one I'm still part of. I love my family. I love my mom and I love my sisters. Uh, my dad is late, so um, most of the time when I'm not acting, when I'm not doing any of you know my careers, of movies or fashion, um, I spend time with, with family. I spend time yeah. with my mom, okay. especially. Uh, like more like more like a mom's boy. Uh, you, you don't have to say that on air. Come on. I like saying it on air. You know, uh, yeah, I, I have a good relationship with my mom, so we, we kind of like spend more time together. You know, my sisters are married, so I just kind of like go to. Which basically. brings us to the next question: Why are you not married? Uh, because I haven't uh, found the one yet. Are you the one? I can get married to myself. No, I'm saying, are you Am the, I one? the one? To Have well, you? well, I, I think I understand what you're talking mm -hmm. about. Um, huh. ah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> I, no, I, I think I'm still, you know, um, building myself up because you know everyone wants to get married to someone they think is perfect without thinking mm -hmm. um, of themselves. So if if you want to, you know, get married to someone, you should think, 
if they deserve you as well. Mm -hmm. So that's that's it. So I'm still breeding myself. I'm still on it. So I'm right now you're hurry. you're you're very single and very searching. Yes, I'm very single. Not not desperately searching. Searching, <laughs> but you're you're keenly searching for that person. Yeah, you, you can use that word. Okay, okay. Mm. So let's delve into what you do. Um, you're an actor. You're a fashion tutor. You're an MC. And all the things that you probably still let us um, know right now. Now, um, how did that start for you? Let's talk about acting. Were you a fashion tutor before you delved into acting? Was it because you were not making so much money when you decided, okay, let me just incorporate the other into it? And right now, which fetches you more money? Okay, so I'm just going to answer the questions. All the in questions. Any order. Yes, in all any right. order. Um, okay, acting fetches more money, really. For you? At the moment. Okay. Um, I didn't start off as an actor, right? All I knew about myself was growing up, I wasn't just, I knew I wasn't just going to be that very um, serious person. Color job kind of guy. Kind of, yeah. I, I always loved entertainment. I, I just loved fun and all of that. Yeah. Okay. So then I started out, um, I had to learn to sew. I had to learn to sew um, from a roadside tailor. Wow. It was, it, was, it was challenging, you know, because at the point I started doing that, um, I, I was having a known face, you know, a mm -hmm. bit of a known mm -hmm. face. So, so uh, but I knew what I wanted, you get. So I had to learn to sew, you know, by the roadside. And then um, eventually I figured that was not all, you know, theories to fashion. So I had to enroll in a proper fashion academy. Okay. You know, um, yeah. So then along the line, while I was in fashion school, um, my sister introduced me to MME song. Okay. Yeah, you, we, everybody knows MME song. We uh, all know. Yeah. <laughs> so my sister introduced <laughs> me to MME song. She's friends with MME song. Okay. With MME song. So she introduced me to MME song. And then um, I was called up for an audition, you know. At um, what age was that? This this wasn't too long ago. This is like uh, 20, 20, 2010, 2010, 2011, okay. you know, about. I was caught up for this audition and I had to enroll. I had to enroll in, in MM's Royal Arts Academy as well, you know, so I'm also a student. I was, or I'm an alumni of, of the institution, yeah. you know, so... Um, there was an audition. I was called for an audition, and that was that was it. That voilà, was it. you just got it. First audition. Connection made you get it, not or you thought it was your talent. Not connection. It mm. was first things first. Thanks to God who gives mm -hmm. the talent. Mm -hmm. So yeah, it wasn't connection. What do you think about people who receive awards? Yeah, because what you just said, uh, you know, for those you already know the question I'm going to. Those who receive awards, and the first thing they say is, "We just want to thank you, Jesus," and you know mm. what they ooze or what they. They, they, they sell to us is not relative to the religion or the what it whatever belief it is that they hold on to. What do you think about such people? We're just going to say, I just want to bless the Lord for giving me this talent. But you look into their lives or whatever they tell us is not is not belief. So it sounds very cliche. Yeah. yeah. You get up on stage. Have you done that before? No. Funny thing is, I haven't I haven't gotten any award. What? But you were nominated. Yeah, but I've been nominated countless times. So okay. I'm tired of the nominations. I want to start getting the awards. <laughs> but the time will come, anyways. You see, um, it's not a bad thing to acknowledge, you know, um, spiritually, mm. who you think or who you believe in. And. Do you get? It's not a bad thing. Because mm -hmm. let, let's look at it this way. Um, first and first, I'm, I'm a firm believer, you know, in Jesus Christ, mm -hmm. and I believe that everything I do, all right, is made possible by Him because mm -hmm. I believe in Him. Yeah. You get. So if. Why do I feel like you're trying to be diplomatic? No, I'm not trying what? to be diplomatic. Yeah. Okay. It's uh, it's it's a personal thing. Yeah, everyone, sure. Everyone is entitled to their opinion. Mm -hmm. You can you can go out there and say I want to thank Buddha. Or mm -hmm. I want to thank you know whatever religion or yeah. whatever belief mm -hmm. you 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 have. Mm -hmm. Do you get? But I I just think it's 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 not a bad thing. It's not a bad thing. Mm -hmm. Yeah. So yeah, I I owe everything to the one I believe in. Yeah, With God. Yeah. Yeah. All right. Okay. So let's move on to your fashion fashion mm. world. Whatever it is you do in fashion. Um, what inspired you to get into it, apart from you just saying, okay, I just want to go to the roadside to learn. What was the inspiration behind that? <coughs> and, 
in your fashion, do you have any limits drawn? I always like to um, put into place cross dresses we have right now. You're laughing. I always like Who putting into in place. Mind? Who's a cross dresser? You I don't know. Do you have anyone in mind? Um, I'm thinking. I, okay, I'm also thinking. Okay, while we're let's thinking. Keep thinking, yes. Then, yeah. All right. So uh, while we talk about cross dresses and all, do you also make clothes for those type of people? Or you have drawn a limit. Okay, this are the clothes I'm going to sew. If you come in and it doesn't, you know, resonate with my being, I'm not going to sew it for you. I, I don't make I don't make outfits for cross dresses. Okay. It's first Why not? Because um, every designer has got his aesthetics. You know, I've got my aesthetics as a designer. Um, I'm not a male. Uh, no, but when you say cross dresses, it's more like you're just sewing a female cloth for a man, or is vice it? versa. No, th this is it. Um, th there's there's a there's a fashion term called androgyny. Okay. Okay. Mm -hmm. Now you could you could have an androgynous look. Mm. You know, trying to make you look. If 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 I if I'm gonna style you, I'm gonna make um, 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 an androgynous uh, kind of outfit for you. It's you trying to, you know, have some strength as a woman in a manly way mm. probably having a jacket on and you have male shoes and all of that yeah. that's different from one who's a cross dresser mm. do you understand so this is what i do in fashion i make dresses for women and i have my aesthetics as a designer all right so i i i it's it's just like if i see a valentino garavani uh, outfit i know it's valentino garavani if i yeah. see uh, calvin klein or you know i see that, uh, i see a carl lagerfeld i just know do you understand because they, they they have they have their own style they have their own so then they have their own clientele they have people who who um patronize that kind of design so i same thing with me it's too growing you know so i'm still trying to discover what is it that is my aesthetics as a designer even That's if I, I have an idea but i'm yeah. gonna put it together okay you understand so if you come to me or if some guy comes to me and says he wants to you know dress like um a woman so i should probably do something for him <laughs> i can be angry i cannot <laughs> <laughs> i don't do that but have you ever been approached by such persons before no, I have never. But then I, 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 I w during my internship with, uh, you know, Monami, mm -hmm. some yeah. really good designer mm -hmm. way back then. He's still in the business, but not like before. Before. Yeah, we had, we had people like that. Okay. You know, come around mm. and, um, yeah, that was Monami. He could do for them, and uh, because I was working with him, there, mm. then I had to. You know, but yeah, that was as a no. brand right now, it's a no no. No, it's a okay. No. So, guys, you have heard it from the man himself cross dressers are not allowed in his company. No, no, hate and, so. um, I'm not hating on any, <laughs> you won't make clothes for them, so no. they're definitely not allowed in your company. But, guys, we'll go on a short one right now, and then when we return, we still have more to come on the core. Keep it locked. Okay, guys, we're moving on to the question to you guys have for our guest today, our renowned actor guest, who, by the way, said he doesn't know Bobrisky, just behind the scenes. And I'm hoping Bobrisky comes for your head pretty soon. <laughs> but moving on to the questions, question number one. Someone says, we see you more in local movies, not <laughs> blog <laughs> busters. Why are you laughing? Is that a choice? Uh, or are those the type of movies you're called on to play roles? Okay, what's it, what, what do you call a local movie? Maybe it's, um, a movie that is not um, in the cinema, something that, I mean, there's not, we, we just see on regular TV. We well, don't have I, I, so know, much I know, I know of um, local and international. <laughs> uh, so when, when they say, oh, we see, okay, maybe I understand what you're trying to say. Yeah. Um, um, I think I do understand. Okay, let's, let's get very serious. Yeah, let's now. get serious. Okay. Um, I think there is time for everything. All right. I think it's about just keep doing what you know how to do best. Just keep moving. All right. The bigger things will come. But that's not to say I haven't done big stuff. I have done quite a number of big stuff. Mm. You know what? What makes a movie big? All right, is where it ends up at the end of the day. We could do a movie. All right, budget-wise, it's big, but it doesn't end up in a cinema. So it doesn't make it um, a bad movie. It doesn't make it a local. Are that really meant to be followed before a movie is aired in cinemas? Of or? course there are. Okay. Of course there are. But like connections see, or just their basic. Well, well, I don't really like to talk about connections, connections. But you see, you see, you, 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 we have some really good movies in the cinema, and we have some really horrible, whack, whack 
stupid movies in the cinema. Wow. And you wonder, how did they make it? Mm -hmm. Well, I won't tell you how. <laughs> <laughs> but you see, I don't think it's about um, calling anything local. It's been, watch, watch a movie and, and you know, what do you, what do you get from it? Does, do you, are you satisfied? Do you understand? Even if you watch it on the poorest TV network, do you understand? It's not where it's at that, that that's the... Oh, I've done a lot of... Uh, personally, I've done really good movies. Mm -hmm. And I've done quite a number that have hit the cinemas. Mm -hmm. And I've, they were sold out in the cinemas. So then people should, um, you know, get facts right. I'm not bothered about that anyway. Mm -hmm. But I'm just trying to say, I think I do understand what you're talking about. You're talking yeah. about, yeah. But, um, maybe they mean being in movies like Wedding Party or... 30 days in Atlanta yeah, no. or, and all of them, mm -hmm. you understand, that time will come. We have a lot of great and fantastic actors that, all right. that, that are not, mm -hmm. you know, yeah. Diplomacy at its peak. <laughs> Second question goes thus. Um, has your sexuality ever been questioned? And how do you handle sexual advances from females and males also? Yes, yes, yes. My, my, it's, it's, my sexuality has been, it's, it's been questioned a lot of time. You know, um, I don't know, a lot of people think, I'm gay, mm. all right? And I think I know where that comes from. Where does okay. that come from? Um, you see, in the fashion world, in the entertainment world, you know, in general, yeah, we have a lot of, um, um, we don't try to, you know, mm -hmm. yeah. we have a lot of, we, we have a lot of, um, them, them, mm. you know, even bisexuals, you know, yeah, gay people, and a all lot of that. them. And, um, um, so when I work with these people, especially when, especially in fashion, in the fashion world, it is a lot of them there. So it, it's people kind of like categorize. Once you have a relationship you know, they, they, with they, them, they, they, they just put you in the same. Put you in the same circle. Oh, he's one of them, and all of that. I don't have issues with gay people. Mm -hmm. you get what I mean? But I'm not gay. Do you get? And sometimes you see your relationship with people, you know, um, could could affect your mannerism in some way. So has know. it affected your mannerism? Yeah, of course it did affect my mannerism. I oh. just had to cut it down. Oh. Yeah, I just had to cut it down because, you see, being a fashion can you, designer... Can you give us a bit of what you used to do there? Not here. <laughs> 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 being, a, you see, being a fashion designer, <laughs> you, you are... You are... It's... it's Sometimes it's kind of spiritual because <laughs> spiritual. Yeah, wow. you see, you, it, it, it's way deeper than we think. Mm -hmm. Trust me. Except you just want to be, um, what do they call these people? Baba Mulika, <laughs> all those kind of tailors. But if you, yeah. if you're really into this the thing and you of surround it. yourself with this people, do you understand that know what they are doing? Yeah. It gets to you. Only you see, the other. When we relate, it, it gets to a point we, we, we relate so much. All right, I feed off. And you feed off from me, mm -hmm. you understand, vice versa. So then, sometimes I, I might tend to want to act the way especially I, especially mm -hmm. when you inspire me. Mm -hmm. Do you understand? So then, a lot of people question uh, my sexuality. Ah, he's gay. Okay, so yeah, now so you're straightening it. He's you're straight like an apple, so he's not gay. Straight at six o'clock, baby. Why? Why are your fingers? Oh, this was one of the things you used to do. Your fingers in your mouth. Okay, just check in. Does that question anything? Perhaps it does. The last question. All right, we're just like 30 seconds. You just round that up. What is the nastiest thing you did as a teenager? Hmm. As a teenager? As a teenager? Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> wow. Hmm. Okay, the only thing I can remember, I, was, I think I was in uh, primary school then, and then um, we had this um, big mango tree. And you know they had warned the, the director had warned everybody. I don't know not to climb. No, not just to climb. There was this really nice fruit, the mango fruit that was just hanging below. Okay. And then um, <coughs> they had warned us not to, but it wasn't ripe. Do okay. you get? But what I did uh, then was okay. Okay, are we are we running? No, 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 no. Please go on. <laughs> Your choice of words are, are rather debatable at the moment. <laughs> please go on. So what I did was pluck it off. I, I dug the ground and buried the mango in there. And I don't know what I was thinking, <laughs> really. I don't know what I was thinking, but I just wanted to get ripe and probably eat. eat it. I think that's one of the nasty things that I think I've well, done. We really didn't get up to so much nasty, do I? Yeah, I, mean, no, I don't think so. You're, I, don't think you're, so. But you're, I was I was really embarrassed that day. Oh, okay. I got the beating of my life. Oh, yeah, yeah. We, all, we all did at a point in time. But guys, yeah. definitely, we'll go on another break right now. I hope you enjoyed him answering your questions. And we have still very, very much more to come on the call. Keep it locked, guys. We'll be right back.
what's up? I'm okay, I'm okay. Everything is up, my brother. They're just, just to come to kill the show. I'm performing tonight, and I just released a song, Comedy versus Music. It's live and direct. Kenny Black, all the way. Oxmoron, we are morons. In the, you know? <laughs> yeah, so I get a question yes. why we ask you today. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Get it, get it. So if dog they back, eh, yeah. and lie on the raw, mm. what thing what they do? Go to the do. Ma! Go to. They go to mess. What's mess? <laughs> mess. You know, that's what goats, that's what goats do. Um, it, well, it depends on the goats, though. Like, um, I said to you that um, the, 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 the female goats, I don't know what they are called, they, 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 they produce a different sound compared to the male goats. Like, a female goat, soprano, I don't know, do you know music? Okay, a female goats, they do soprano. But you have the male goats, they have a um, tick boy, like... And we're moving on to the hot topics, things that are trending right now in Nigeria, outside Nigeria, and basically all over the world. And we have with us still Ifani Kalu. So first hot topics is, it's a sad one, David O losing three of his friends, I think in the space of a week. And um, we've heard lots of people backlashing him saying, you know, you are the one who killed them. You're a ritualist, it's an Islamic cleric thing. You also came up last, was it yesterday, and said, you know, we debunk or we disown David Doe and everything. What's just your take on the saga going on? It's a pretty sensitive issue, and, you know, people are just saying all sorts. But what, what's your take on it? <laughs> okay, um, sad one. Um, really sad. But this is what I have to say. Um, it's really very sensitive and people shouldn't just say things that they are not sure of first and first no one can really tell what happened to those guys and you cannot blame or you cannot say David Doe killed these people mm -hmm. it's totally wrong except you have a proof except he's been um, convicted of you know the, the I, I don't think there is a case here even you get but you know people will always want to talk. talk people will always want to talk so I it's a sad thing to lose three people in the space mm -hmm. of a week. Really sad. But then you you can't you can't you can't say David killed them. Mm. <laughs> you mm -hmm. really cannot say. You, you know why you can't say that? Really waiting. Have you ever been accused of mm. something that you did not do? The it's crazy. So before you get to accuse somebody, you should be really sure. Mm. There are a lot of people rotting in the prisons for for cases they know they nothing never about. Commented. Do you mm. understand? So, but if, if you if you're not in the person's shoes you just want to talk you just want to talk you just want to you, you want to bring people down and just say things that were you there mm -hmm. you were not when there it happened funny thing you know how rumors are, are crazy how people just say um oh one person says something and the other person picks it and, and the, the moment the other person is spreads. trying to relate to it another person is it blows it blows it out of proportion, proportion. As he was there you get so nobody says anything about david Doe except and unless you know we are sure no. you know and th there's, there's a proof that you know he did that all right so moving on to a rather interesting one um Burner boy put up a tweet and he said the way i genuinely dislike pastors preachers etc i might have to knock one of them the f out one of these days i know god will be happy um I saw, I saw that yesterday. What did you think about it? I when was you saw really it? disappointed. Oh, okay. Yeah, I was really d disappointed. You see, the thing is, your upbringing, your upbringing matters a lot. Mm. Do you get? I'm not saying he was brought up wrongly. <laughs> you know, so I was about to ask that question. <laughs> like, okay. No, that, that, that's, that's not what I, 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 I meant. You see, the thing is, let's let's look at it this way. If Bonner Boy was brought up in oh god, <laughs> okay. Let's say he was brought up in a you know, very serious Christian home, mm -hmm. you know, or he was surrounded, you know, by this, because I, I mean, we know a little bit of his, his background and his, yeah, yeah. You get, I, I think he wouldn't say some things, or he wouldn't make such statements. You but I mean, it's, it's a matter he, of understanding. He may be coming from the, we have seen people, we've been seeing pictures and videos of, you know, so-called clerics, you know, doing, performing things that are, you know. When, when, so when maybe that's, that's can, the path he's come. Can you have, can you have a fake Nigerian dollar? Mm. Can you have a fake Nigerian dollar? No. Why? Why would, it's not even our currency. Yeah, because there is, mm. yeah. 
You see, now, you can only have a fake Naira. Mm. You can only have a fake Naira because there is an original Naira. Yeah. You understand what I mean? Mm -hmm. You can only have a fake dollar because you have an original dollar. dollar yeah. So nobody can fake something that is not there. Mm. Do you understand? So when you see, there are a lot of pastors that do wrong stuff. Yeah. All right, that pretend to be real. That's because we have, the, the, it's, it's a real deal. Hmm. I'm not trying to go He's spiritual. He's okay. That's <laughs> you know, deep. So I'm, I'm not trying to go through, but I'm just, you know, let, let's just have it on, on the, the surface, surface level. On the surface level. Do you understand? So you see, when you have a lot of people do wrong things in a particular sect, all right, think about it. It probably is the real deal. That's why they are faking it. Mm. So don't come up and, and criticize pastors and stuff now. Let's don't go there. Okay. All right. You're already <laughs> warming up. Get some spiritual thing in there. Okay. So guys, definitely. I think this is all we're going to be taking for Hot Topics right now. But um, we'll go on another break. And um, yes, we still have Let's Play Silly Games, Fun Facts, and so much more for you guys. Keep it locked. We'll be right back. And it is time for Let's Play Silly Game. <laughs> okay, so we're playing the game today, Wim or Dear. <laughs> I'm fearing for you, but I will start my own. <laughs> so, Wim or Dear. <clears throat> Wim or Dear, tell me to be a Dear. Okay, so I'm going to ask you to act like Romeo from Romeo and Juliet. <laughs> you know what to act? You know, okay, so it's a really <laughs> Romeo. This man is not a lovey dovey man. Alright, go on, it's time for you. Okay, we for there. Yeah. <clears throat> <laughs> the laughter is evil. <laughs> okay, um... Can you take off what you have to say? H-E-L-L! Eh, no! Hell, no! No way! Wimp! Wimp! I am not taking it off. I am not. Do you know how many hours it took to pay to do this? Yeah, that's this the thing. So I just, I just want to say a bit of you that around. You will. It's on my phone. Right. <laughs> Don't worry. Alright, so, um... <clears throat> Wimp or dear? Okay, so I am going to ask you to work for 30 seconds. Yes. <laughs> to work for 30 seconds. No, you can't be serious. To work? No, no, you can't be serious. Uh-uh. You say I should dare you. Who, who dare does that? Do you, have you seen any guy that works? Oh, yeah. Trust I've seen me. A, I've seen a, I've seen a couple or more. I'm not. That's when. I think you'll be the first to do that. No, I wouldn't be. I mean, yeah, get on with it. Wow! <laughs> <laughs> Okay, it's your turn. <laughs> your soul, your name. Okay, just you did, did you do the same stuff for like okay, twenty seconds. No. You should. I've, um. It was just you. Ah, know. I need I need ginger for this. <laughs> My mother was not watching this right now. <laughs> it was just you more. Yeah, you should. I'm going to twerk. Yeah, good. I need. <coughs> How do I twerk right now? How do people On twerk? On the chair. <laughs> no, no. <laughs> That's some, that's some cultural dance, man. No, that's not working. I feel like I'm working. Leave it. Really? I moved my body. All no. right, it's fine. <laughs> All right, so I'm going to dare you right now to to, um, <clears throat> to to recite the alphabet from A to Z without opening your teeth. <laughs> like that, the teeth closed. Your lips don't move. My lips don't move. Mm. 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 No, no, no. How will I ever say D without the lips? <laughs> don't do it, don't do it. Don't do it. I can't do it. You have to you already started. I mean, come on. Just do it. No, mm. no, just do it. It can't work. It can't. Hey. Mm. See, your teeth, your dirty dead. No, people, the arrangement of dentition is different. It's not, it's the same. <laughs> I don't think I can do that. You it won't work. Let me just try. Can you try it? Can you do it? I'm not going to do it. 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 
you are the next person. Okay, I think I've been really cool and easy with you. So me, I've been what? Yeah, you've been really hard. Hey, it's okay. <laughs> you are nice analyzing my clothes, so I will take it. Eh? You are a joker, this man. <laughs> you are analyzing the clothes. Very easy, just give me your earrings. Okay, that's all right. No, it's free. No, we can't take it. <laughs> Did you? Both, yeah. Ah, it's fair. Ah. <laughs> Mom is able to remove the. Okay, there's, there's nothing else to worry about. That's all. <laughs> hey, I think. I'll be nah. All right. <clears throat> so, Wimpo, dear. Okay, so I dare you to do 10 push-ups right now. On the yeah, just on the okay. Okay. What time is this? Okay, I tell you, I dare you to do um, 20 triceps steps. That's uh, uh, 20. That's, that's 20. At a goal. At a goal. You don't breathe though. I don't. <laughs> yeah, I do. <laughs> Alright, this is. Ah, uh, ah. Uh. Right? O'Shea batters. One, two. No, at my count. Ah, uh, ah. Uh. Really? Yes, now. Uh, oh, yeah. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, okay. eight. You have to already shake it. Nine, ten, ten. Uh, uh, let's count now from ten to from one. 10, to one. Uh, ten, nine, eight, seven, six, five. Uh. Four, eh? <laughs> Three, <laughs> two, and one. Oh. Hey. Right. So we got that, yeah? You already planted. Your hands were vibrating. See, I can't. No, my hands are vibrating. I can see sweat too. Yeah, I would sweat. Of <laughs> you would sweat just doing 20. <laughs> yeah. All right, so that is, that's definitely all, guys. Um, really? I did. Yes. It ends with me. Yeah, it ends with you. You're the guest now, so everything ends with you. We have to go on a break so you can catch your breath. So guys, I hope you enjoyed this segment of Let's Play Silly Games. We really have so much more for you guys. You really have to keep your eyes glued to your devices because we'll be right back right after this. What's the son name of um, President Buhari? I don't think he has son name. <laughs> son name? Muhammadu. Are you joking with me right now? Um, his name is President Muhammadu Buhari. What's his son name though? Buari. President Buari, what's him being son name? Ah. Yeah, no, no. Full <laughs> time! All I know is that when he's sick, he goes to London. That's what I know. I don't know about his son name. Ah? Huh? Why you be Nigerian? Ah, uh, no, be Nigerian. Me, I be Biafran. What happened? <laughs> I don't know if he has any other son name. I don't know. I have not heard his son name before. Hey! Woo! I think say na Igbo. And can, can you do this I don't I don't care, I don't care. I, in fact, I'm tired of this country. I'm tired. You mean that? This sauce is not. You said? Action People Congress. And it is time for the peak or ditch. So, the first set of people we're going to be pitching <coughs> against each other. Are you ready? Yeah. Okay, are you sure? Yeah, I am. Okay, so first is Belinda. Afa and I hope I got that right yeah, and Rose Kadiri. <laughs> <laughs> what a laughter. <laughs> so who you pick who you ditch? My people. <laughs> <laughs> we know. Uh, really? Eh. Come on now, no, we can't do this one. Now. No, we have to. At it's all. called pick or ditch. I pick both. <laughs> no, you can't pick both. You have to pick one and then ditch the other one. Really? Yep. Come on, you don't do this now. Why can't we do it? Nah. This is not right. It doesn't have to be right. Uh -uh. Things are never right. But you've, you've had other people do this, right? Yeah, I mean, other, and they do it. They do it? Yes. Are you sure? Of course. What did they say? You can watch clips after this, but right now it's your turn. Ha. Huh. Come on now. Why are you? I don't know. This is not fair. It doesn't have to be fair. <laughs> so who would you pick between would pick? Belinda? Okay, you know what? Mm, the, the, the thing is... Mm. Um... I can pick both. No. No, what is, this is what I mean, all right? Um, in different contexts. 
<laughs> see, don't apply diplomacy to this. Speak uh, or ditch. See, I, I, I could pick Belinda. All right, so you pick Belinda you the and then why I pick Belinda. No, and I can you also know what? pick Ruth. You can pick, pick Ruth. Belinda and say, okay, I've known her for you know quite a number of years as mm. compared to the other person. So yes, that's like a yeah, 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 yeah. I've, I've 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 known Belinda. I think I think um. Way, 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 way back. Way back. All right. So you pick Belinda and Ditch Rose. All right. So moving on to the second segment, you right? Saw that, <laughs> you so we have the veteran actors, Olu Jacobs versus Ed Edoche. Who are you, who are you teach? Do you want to murder me? Look at your eyes. Who would you pick who you ditch? Hmm? Hmm? I think I'll pick Pete. Uh, uh, why would you pick? Him over um, Olu Jacobs. Um, I think I love his depth mm. of acting. Okay. And um, um, I don't want to sound tribalistic. I was going to cheap that in. You know, but I easily relate with Pete. Mm. Yeah. That's all. Say so what is it for you to pick from this one? But the first segment, I can't pick. No, 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 no. no. <laughs> All right. And so we'll be moving on to the freestyle segment. Um, I don't know you to be a rap artist, but we'll just see what you do for us. Uh, just do a freestyle. It can be acting. It can be anything. So. <clears throat> so what's your name again? Faye. Faye, F A Y. Faye. Yes. Faye, I. I don't know how to say this, but I have. I've always loved you from a distance. And I. <laughs> Is that good? <laughs> keep doing it, keep doing it, keep doing I'm it. Done. You should not know nah. You're already raising hopes that you're not cute, they're like coin. That's how you should be. Comes to reality. It was not camera you were speaking to. The face the or the camera should be. It's okay. Over ten. Over ten. Give yourself a score. No, you should do that. No, no, I what always want you, you to. It was good. It was good. I right? like the expression. Yeah, great. Yes. Awesome. Awesome. Yeah. Alright, so okay. So what? We're good? We're good. Very good. good. Very good. Okay, so take us on a break. <laughs> take us on a break now. <laughs> All right, then, guys. Um, we're going on a break now, and um, we'll be right back. Okay, so aside Tuesday and Thursday, what other days starts with a T? Starts with a T. Tuesday. Sunday, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, 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 Saturday. I don't even know what to say to him right now. I beg, how does Saturday start with a T? Please explain. It's with a T now. I have T, but it's just that like his own T is in the middle. Thank God it's Friday. <laughs> this palm, guys. Like, I can't even do it right now. Uh -uh. You want to change them for me? Let me, all of us, they yell. I answer the question, he correct, they can't change them for me. My guy, I failed it. Just admit that I don't know it. Let me tell you. Abia Mo, Abia Mo, Abia Mo. I'll just tell me you don't know it. Let me tell you the answer. <laughs> tell me you don't know it. Okay. You are failed, Joe. Just tell me the answer first. Because I'm nice, I will. Hey guys, my name is Ifani Kalu. I'm an actor. I don't know. Most of you know me, and most <laughs> probably do not know me. Uh, yeah, so basically, you guys expect more good movies from me. Uh, yeah, I've been up to a lot, really. Uh, I've been working quite a lot. And just watch out. Yeah, so many good stuff coming. And then. Um, yeah, I don't think I think that that's pretty all. Uh, yeah, basically. So just just expect more from me, and that's it. That's pretty. Thank you.
It has been a very, very, very interesting program and interview thus far with Ifani Kalu. But guys, remember that you can log on to our website. The interview is going to be there and our YouTube channel. The website is at www.dailyrulife.com and YouTube, it is at dailyrulife. And definitely follow me up at, on Instagram and Facebook at IFA Balugu and on Twitter at IFA Balugu 11. E, yeah. Ifani Kalu. Ifani Kalu. Kalu on Kalu, yeah. On Instagram. Yeah. That's all. That's all. Yeah, you pretty much don't say much about yourself on social media platforms. We mm -hmm. wonder why, but wanna say something? Nah. nah. All right, guys. So till we come your way again on the core, remember to leave love and be happy always. You only leave once and make the best today of your life from today till eternity. We love you. Bye for now.